think Poetry Africa is a forum for intercultural encounters between artists and between artists and audiences. And I don't think there are many events in South Africa that gather together such a diversity of poets from so many cultures and countries, which this year includes Mozambique, Malawi, Zimbabwe, Uganda, Democratic Republic of Congo, Nigeria, Turkey, India, and of course, South Africa. And apart from the presentations and performances in the theater here every night and at the Bat Center on Saturday, there are over 20 activities around the city of Durban and in surrounding areas, in tertiary institutions, in community centers, and in public spaces. Poets will visit 22 schools to engage with learners and encourage interest in literature. There are book launches, schools poetry competitions, and with all of this, Poetry Africa is part of that arrowhead in which culture facilitates development. So the poets are the agents in the process. And it's my pleasure now to welcome the participants of Poetry Africa. Dumela, San Bonani, Namaste, Huyanand, Hello Durban. I wanted to greet as many people as I could. Assalamu alaikum, the Muslims. Just because I felt so included and so welcomed and so seen by Durban. And I can't tell you what a, a gift that is and a skill that is. And if you ever think um, what is special about your city, it's that. It's a place that you love being and that I love being. And I, I really want to thank you. And I want to ambivalently thank the poets here because they made me cry every night and I'm I sort of my my bag is filled with crumpled tissue paper because my body couldn't lie when I was hearing everybody here much much younger somewhat more elder all of them made me cry and um, that doesn't happen at all very often Poetry Africa Durban thank you for having me for the 50 millionth time I'm infinitely grateful I would not be the artist that I am had it not been for this platform and the many times that it has shown me love and shown me support.